The following contest is brought to you by Preston Hardware and Popeye Supplements. Making his way down to the ring. He weighs 160 pounds, point four. He's 30 years old. He's a personal trainer. He's got 10 years experience in the sport of karate. He's wrestled in high school. His name is Kevin Dorion. He trains out of Team Bushido. And guess what, Lewis? This is his debut fight. He's been wanting to do this for a long, long, long time. And he's debuting this evening here at Heroes Combat League. Well, I mean, ha having a, a wrestling and karate base is a... It, absolute fantastic base for mixed martial arts and he's a personal trainer so we know he's an athlete very excited to see him we talked to him earlier he's a very cool guy he's a personal trainer to personal friends of mine i'm very excited to see him fight he says he's a short stocky guy and he likes to use that to his advantage he was very very calm during the interview earlier on today he was absolutely very focused absolutely and, uh, sign of maturity that's for sure and his opponent making his way down to the cage. He weighs 164 pounds. He's 29 years old. He trains out of Pat Node Martial Arts. And uh, his name is Alex LaSalle. Get this, Alex has fought in bars. He's known as a bar fighter. And uh, he's decided that he wants to step his game up and leave bar fighting to focus on cage fighting. And tonight, Lewis, he makes his debut and he loves to box and he's looking to push himself in the cage. Well, this is a fantastic decision for him because bar fighting is stupid as hell. Why not do it legally with rules and with skill and athleticism? Amen to that. This is Team Bushido versus Team Pat Node Martial Arts. It's, it's the president of Heroes Combat League and the vice president putting their guys up fighting each other. You gotta love Fighting it. out of the blue corner, weighing in at 165 pounds and making his in-ring debut, representing Team Bushido MMA. Kevin Dorian! And fighting out of the Renault guy's corner, weighing in at 165 pounds, also making his in-ring debut, and representing Patno Martial Arts, Alex LaSalle! Here we go, Dorian versus LaSalle, mixed martial arts action, Heroes Combat League triple threat. Two guys making their debut. This is going to be fantastic. <laughs> Dorio looks like he's stalking him. Really, looks like he wants that takedown. But LaSalle able to use his range to keep him away. Lasell taking a really low stance to try and counter the shortness of Dorian. Dorian attempting to close that distance again does, but Lasell able to push off. LaSalle doing a good job of using jabs, his range, kicks, and being the taller man in the fight. Nice leg kick thrown by Dorian. Dorian is corner asking him to throw jabs. I guess to set up the takedown. Head kick attempt by LaSalle and misses. LaSalle fighting very smart, using his jab and cross and head kick. Oh, go. but the takedown comes from Dorian. Looks like it. LaSalle trying to get a triangle here and Dorian attempting to pass that guard. Lasalle's got an ankle. He's attempting an ankle lock submission. Look for a leg lock here. 
Kevin Dorian back to his feet, and he lets LaSalle back up. Dorian's very aggressive there. He's swinging really, really fast. Nice head kick thrown by LaSalle. I do have to wonder about Dorian letting LaSalle back up because I believe LaSalle was having the better exchanges on the feet. Just using his length smarter. Nice combination there by LaSalle, left, right. Dorian going for the takedown. LaSalle shaking his head no after he pushes him off. He wants to keep it standing. Both guys very focused here, very interesting. One seconds left in the round, first round. Very interesting first round, you know. Something neat happened at the end there. Kevin threw a kick while LaSalle threw a punch. And the range on the punch was just the same as the range on the kick. So, it, you know, Dorian has some, some distance to cover. That is a fact. And let's see if he goes for that takedown in round two. Myself uh, showing some great fight maturity in keeping that distance and keeping that low base. Again, he's got a great coach in Sifu Pat Marcel. He sure does, and, and it's interesting because this is a guy who, who's an alleged uh, bar fighter, but he's very conservative in his movement and very strategic and uh, w well aware of the fact that his opponent wants to take him to the ground, whereas he'd rather keep it standing. Well, I mean, I think we have a case of a good coach and a good student, you know, someone yeah. who's willing to learn and someone who's willing to be coached. And uh, take. let's see what happens in round two. Heroes Combat League, triple threat. Dorian versus LaSalle, round two. Let's see what happens. Tall man versus short man. Both athletes clearly have great cardio here. They're, they're not oh. showing any sign of uh, fatigue. Which really says a lot for their debut as well. Because they've battled the nerves and won, it appears. Leg kick thrown by Dorian. Another leg kick. He's trying to use that leg kick to close the distance. LaSalle able to throw him off when he went for that takedown. LaSalle looking very confident in his striking. He does have some very technical striking. And he's got that length. He's, those combinations are landing. Dorian appears to be shutting his eyes a bit when he's reaching for that strike, and that could be because of the counters he's eating. Corner asking uh, Dorian to circle. Double jab, triple jab by Dorian. And able to put the pressure on LaSalle there and back him up. Nice leg kick thrown by Dorian. Big leather thrown by LaSalle there. And the, oh, Ooh. Dorian just misses with a big right hand. Ooh. Entertaining fight here. Absolutely entertaining fight. Dorian throwing some feints now, which is pretty smart. Eats a face teeth, though. Big La right by LaSalle. LaSalle really finding his range now and able to tee off a little bit. Dorian may be hurt here. I think so, Lewis. And LaSalle teeing off and showing great restraint by not throwing the knee to the head. Dorian eating some big shots. Referee. Those covering up. The referee will stop this. Referee stops and it. And he does. The second round, Alex LaSalle's debut, and he wins. Via TKO. Well, he hurt Dorian and he did not give him a chance to recover. He kept connecting flush with those straight punches, which, man, he's a, he's a very good technical striker. Great effort by uh, Dorian. Absolutely. Obviously, both competitors. But Bad respect to both competitors for getting in this cage. And I'm certain we'll see them both again. I believe it. And the winner of this contest, as a result of referee stoppage, fighting out of the Renault Guys corner.
Fantastic debut for Alex LaSalle. Very impressed with his, his using his length and his technical striking. Those punches were very hard.